All right. What's going on everybody? Marvelous Beats back again with another top 10 video for you. Wait, what? Where? Um, this isn't my studio. What the heck is going on? Psych! Your boy got a green screen. I am super excited as you guys can see. You know, a new addition to the studio. Hopefully it's gonna make these videos a little more interesting. And uh, yeah, I don't know where to go from here, but uh, let's get back to the intro. <laughs> Did you guys see that? It's pretty easy, you know, it just goes up, down. That's what she said, man. All right, so we have another top 10 video. This time we're doing Ski Mask, The Slump God, one of my favorite artists on the planet. I know you guys have been asking for this video for a while and it's finally here. I am back on the grind and I'm gonna be posting a lot more frequently. Yo, isn't this crazy, this green screen thing? Like I can see him now and I can kind of, you know, bug him a little bit. He he looks a little weird though today, doesn't he? Do you guys like the shirt he's wearing? I don't know. And yeah, I'm super excited to bring all this new content. Oh, by the way, like the idiot forgot to mention, there's gonna be a weekly rap news episode on the channel. So there's gonna be two video uploads a week. So this guy completely forgot to say that, but uh, I came back to help him out. Oh, one last thing. I just had to say that uh, this guy, can you just get out of here, please? Like seriously. Get he can be so annoying. Yeah, if you are new to the channel and you enjoy this video, make sure to absolutely smash the subscribe button or just click it or hit it. I really appreciate it. Also, make sure to drop a like and a comment letting me know what you guys think of my list. Did I butcher it? Did I f it up? What do you guys think? I want to hear in the comment section down below. And to all the people that are already subscribed, all I gotta say is I appreciate you guys so much. That comes from the heart. And also make sure to follow me on my social media on Instagram and Twitter, especially Instagram because I've been posting and doing live streams a lot on there. My accounts are at Beats by Marv. I'll have it up on the screen somewhere here. You guys will see it. It'll also be linked in the description down below. With no further ado, let's get into this lit video. We got top 10 Ski Mask, the Slump God songs. Let's get it. All right, for number 10 on this list, we have a major throwback, one of Ski Mask's, actually, it's his first ever released song on a SoundCloud. The song is called Broly. By the way, got my coffee, I got lots of energy. I'm filming earlier today, so it's gonna be a good video. Like I said, this was the first ever song that Ski Mask had released on his SoundCloud, and it also features the late and great X. It is also a very short song coming in at one minute and 15 seconds with Ski opening the song up with one verse and then X kind of closing it out with a verse slash hook kind of thing. They both rap for about 30 seconds. So to put in context how old this song really is, it was released actually in June of 2015, so almost four years ago now. Which is crazy to think that 2015 was four years ago now. It makes me really, you know, feel old and uh, kind of depressed. Also, I wanted to point out that Ski's vocal delivery and kind of flows back then on this track were kind of similar to his current flow and rhyme scheme and vocal cadence, which is super dope to see, you know, the similarities, but also the progression over time. Although the mix is not great, the song is just so lit. Do people say lit anymore? I don't know. It's 2019. Is that almost as bad as dabbing? I'm not going to do it. I would never dab on camera because shut the f up. I will f laser you with alien. All right, now for number nine on this list, we have another song featuring the late and great X, another classic throwback. We have the song H2O. So H2O or water, you know, same was released on You Will Regret. Like I said, this also features X. He's like a brother from another mother to ski, and it's just so dope whenever they get on a track together. They have such amazing chemistry. It's a smash record. I don't really have much to say about it. It's just a great turn up song. If you wanna get, like I said, lit with your friends, this is the song to listen to. All right, for number eight on this list, we have the first song from Beware the Book of Eli. The song is called Coolest Monkey in the Jungle. Like a lizard. So for me, this song was a standout record on the project and it features fire production and an assist from Murda Beats. He's one of the hottest producers in the game and he killed this record. This beat was perfect for Ski Mask's flow, super unique. And I also love what he did with the whole H&M controversy and then kind of turning it into a positive thing with the title of the song and the theme of the song. If you guys know, you know. And if you guys want to find out more, just go Google H&M, coolest monkey in the jungle controversy. It'll come up, but uh, yeah, I love what Ski did on this track and it had to get a spot on this list. All right, now for number seven on this list, the song is two words, one syllable per word. The track is called La La. 
All right, so this song is from the project Stokely. It is Stokely's first appearance on this list. The song definitely showcases Ski's darker side. The whole production from Ronnie J with that distorted 808 bass line really suits Ski's vocal delivery on this track. And I also wanted to point out the music video done on the Lyrical Lemonade channel. It really goes hand in hand with this song with, you know, Ski kind of in the dark wilderness. I just love everything about this song. And also, this was the song that Ski Mask came on stage with at the Death Race for Love tour, and it really set the tone for the whole concert. Okay, now moving on to number six on this list, we have a song that uh, the name just cracks me up. The track is called Like a Soccer Mom. <laughs> Yeah, only Ski could come up with that. So this was the hit record from Ski Mask's old SoundCloud EP, Slaps from My Drop Top Minivan. I think that's what it's called. Yes, Ski Mask has been wild in with these names. I absolutely love how creative he is with these kind of projects and everything about him is just so creative. Bro, what are you talking about, man? All right, moving on. The song Like a Soccer Mom was released way back in July of 2016. So about a year into his earlier SoundCloud rap days. In this track, the main things that stand out to me are Ski's lyricism and his unique ad-libs. I feel like this was kind of when he was really hitting his stride in terms of his ad-lib game. And as you guys all know, if you're a fan of Ski Mask, he's one of the best in rap at ad-libs. Hey, Hey. Yeah, I tried. Why are you the way that you are? Also, before I forget, the song also features a sample in the production from one of my favorite childhood shows, Codename Kids Next Door. If you guys don't watch that show, or I mean didn't watch that show as a kid, you might as well just unsubscribe from the channel. Click off this video. I don't really want a part. No, I'm just joking. Please do not do that. Do the opposite. If you're new, hit the subscribe button. All right, so now we are entering the top five portion of this top 10 video. We have one of the fan favorite Ski Mask songs. By the way, I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video, I made a community post like four days ago as of this video being recording, as of this video being recorded, asking you guys what your favorite Ski Mask Slump God song was. And at the end of the video, I'm going to be reading all your comments and giving you guys some shout outs. But like I said, this was a fan favorite. The song is called Nuketown. So once again, this song is about the Project Stokely, one of my absolute favorite albums of all time. The song features Juice World, and I was lucky enough to see them perform this live at the Death Race for Love tour. So let's go briefly check out that concert footage again. <laughs> So this song in terms of energy really reminds me of Take a Step Back featuring X in terms of Ski and Juice just going back and forth and getting super hype on the hook especially. In fact, when I first heard Juice World kind of make an appearance on that song, I didn't even recognize him because I'm not used to him kind of doing that scream rap sound. I'm more used to the all girls are the same lucid dreams kind of vibes. All right, now for number four on this list, we have one of Ski Mask's funniest name songs. You guys all know it. The song is called Baby White. Burberry, church, coat, you smoke oregano, I'm smoking on Nick Cat. So this song is also from the project You Will Regret, similar to H2O that made an appearance earlier in this video and on this list. This song is definitely one of Ski Mask's best lyrical performances that I've ever heard on any of his tracks he's released to date. Also again, I wanted to point out the song name. Only Ski Mask could name a song Baby Wipe and not get weird looks from the entire rap community. It's true. All right, for number three on this list, we have a huge record of Ski Mask's last project, Stokely. The song is called Faucet Failure. Okay. <laughs> Get in and if you're this song was the most listened to song off his last album. In fact, it had over 5 million more streams than his second most listened to song, Nuketown, on SoundCloud. This song also just went platinum, so it was the first single on that album to go platinum, which is insane. I'm so proud of Ski, and he definitely deserves it. He's been working his off and grinding in the rap game for a while. Also, another standout point about this record and why I believe it is as popular as it currently is, is the unorthodox and kind of wacky production that just suits Ski Mask so perfectly. All right, guys, it's starting to get really intense in here. Moving on to the top two portion of this list. And number two, we have one of my personal favorite songs of all time. The song is called Take a Step Back. So this song was originally released in May of 2016 on SoundCloud and then was later released on the project You Will Regret X at Ski. Just the energy, like come on, it is next level. When I saw Ski perform it live at the Death Rates for Love tour, it just took the crowd to another level that I've never seen before at a live concert. And uh, yeah, let's check out the concert footage right now. <laughs> 
All right, to sum up this song, it just had such a huge influence in rap with those heavy distorted 808s. The production, the delivery that Ski and X brought on that track was so different at the time. All right. It's time for the number one track on this top 10 Ski Master Slump God songs list. It's all built up to this one point, and I'm super excited to say that the best Ski Master Slump God song that he has ever made is Catch Me Outside. How about that? No, it's just called Catch Me Outside, but you know, the meme, that's where he got the name from. Cut to the clip. This song was also from the Project You Will Regret Deluxe or Reloaded. It features production from the amazing, one of the best producers of all time, Timbaland. But yeah, after Ski Master hopped on the instrumental and made Catch Me Outside, Timbaland, Missy Elliott both gave him cosigns. And this song went on to be one of his biggest songs ever. And in my opinion, that's why it's number one on this list, his best song ever as well. All right, so that sums up this video. No, it doesn't sum up this video quite yet. Actually, we're gonna go through and read your comments right now, give you guys some shout outs. Appreciate everybody that dropped a comment on my last community post. Let's see what you guys had to say as to what is your favorite Ski Master Slump God song. Let's check it out. All right, so we got Ricky Bobby, Human Centipede, Like a Soccer Mom, Life Short. So one of the four songs with uh, Comment Section Savior was aligned with my uh, list as well. Potato Ducky Boy Yeet uh, said Nuketown and Lala, so both those songs made the list. Alok Artin says Faucet Failure is Best. I can't really shout out everybody, but hopefully you guys can still read your comments on the screen. Where's the video, my guy? Well, it's here now. I'm sorry. I know it's delayed, but uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying it. Baby Wipe, Adult Swim, Broly, hey, day one ski fat as well. I like it. Oh, this comment has 10 likes. I'm gonna give it a like as well. Nuketown, Catch Me Outside, and Baby Wipe. Ryan Madrid, 170. I like the way you think. All right, thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Make sure you guys drop a comment letting me know what you guys think of my list and which videos you want to see next. There's going to be a weekly rap news video and then there's going to be a top 10 artist battle or I actually have a new series coming as well that I'm excited to share with you guys uh, once a week as well. So there's going to be two videos dropping a week. I'm going to be posting a lot more frequently and I'm also going to be live streaming as well in the very near future. So stay tuned for that. I'm super excited. Going to be listening to all your guys' music. If you enjoyed this video, Video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. It really means a lot to me and helps the channel grow. I'm Marvelous Beats. I'll catch you guys in the next video very soon. It's going to be a rap news video for the week. Hopefully, you guys enjoy it. I'm out. Peace.